Hello and welcome, I'm Chris, and on this video I'm gonna be showing you a root drag using the latest liquid jewels by Leighton House. Now if you haven't seen the quick start video, I'll link it up here and in the description below. But this range of 23 demi-permanent colors with no ammonia, vegan friendly, deposit only, give you great options when it comes to your hairdressing. Whether you wanna do a root smudge, root tap, whether you wanna tone or simply add some color to the hair. This will give you so many options and it has a clear as well to use as a standalone treatment or to mix with the colors to create your own palette. And of course, they're all intermixable. Now today I'm gonna to be doing this technique on a lightened block. We're coming into Christmas. A lot of people have had their hair lightened during the summer period. They wanna go a little bit darker, but again, people that have generally gone light can be a bit unsure. So using these that are gradually gonna fade off enables them to try a color out or to simply have a multitude of different colors over the Christmas period. So I'm gonna be picking a nice root smudge and then going into a tone on the ends. Now, if you wanna pre-lighten the hair, there's a range of three lightening systems and a high lift system in the Leighton house. So again, link is in the description below to check those out, those out. Okay, so as you can see here, I've pre-washed, damped down and towel dried my block. So what I'm gonna do here is I'm gonna go on the root with an 8NVA, a mocha. Now, I'm gonna slightly darken that down, and you're able to do this by adding up to 10% of the liquid chrome into your color. Now, I don't wanna to go too dark, I don't wanna drop down to a six, but I do wanna drop this base down just a little bit, just so I know it's gonna cover, but at the same time that it's not too dark for the client. And then on the ends, I'm gonna be smudging that into the alabaster. Now, there's two ways you can go about this, but the processing time for these is only 20 minutes. So I could go through and do my root drag, and then of course, I could go back through and do my ends. But just for the purposes of speed, I'm gonna do it section by section. I'm gonna do my root, and then I'm gonna wipe my hands off, and then I'm gonna go through the ends. So this should be a nice, quick process for you. So I'm just gonna mix up, and like I said, mixing ratio is one to two, and in the base color, I can add up to 10% of my liquid chrome. Okay, so I've sectioned out the front of my hair, and I'm just gonna start on my back. Okay, so I'll show you a couple of sections here on the back. So like any root drag, I'm gonna do about two and a half inches. Then you can either use your fingers to bring it through, or I use one of these combs that has like a roller built in it apply the ends and then use my fingers after that. So going in on the root and applying. Now when this comes out of the bottle, it's very liquid. Then you mix the 1.5 activator with it and it sort of thickens up into sort of like this gel, which is really nice to work with. Just lift it up, make sure that I've got thorough saturation right the way through that section. Okay, and then either with your fingers, wide tooth comb, or like I said, I've got this rolling comb, just pop that in, pull that through. See if you need to add a little bit more anywhere, just if it's absorbed in. And then of course, go through the ends. I'm now putting through that alabaster. Again, just making sure I thoroughly coat the hair. And then just with my fingers, I'm just gonna gently make sure it gets worked through and smudge that line through. And that's it, I'm gonna work my way up now through the back of the head, doing exactly that, nice and quickly whether you want to do this at a seat or whether you want to do it at the basin.
Okay, so just before I move on to the front, I'm just gonna give this another quick comb through. And now on to the front. Now when it comes to the front, exactly the same principle. But again, if you wanted to sort of foil some pieces out before you start to leave more of a money piece, or if you wanted to do less of a drag here, coming into more, perfectly up to you, perfectly to what you want or your client wants. Okay, so I am gonna come at a back diagonal and I am gonna do less of a drag up there and more further down, just so I've got a tiny bit of a money piece going on. Okay, so that's it complete. Now I've just got to time it. I could probably take the back off as it's sort of near there in that 20 minute time, but I'll take it to the back wash and I'll have a visual look and then I will present it to you. So I'll see you in a second. I really look forward to seeing your mixes, colors, and concoctions. Don't forget to tag us on Instagram and Facebook. And if you've got any questions, leave some messages there or in the comments section below. And I'll see you next time.